Everybody's devastated and people are just like, can't believe we lost him. We're learning more about a Cumberland County plane crash earlier this week that killed the pilot. 911 calls reveal that pilot. Vass Gellin called his flight instructor about engine trouble just before the crash. Authorities say his plane went down Tuesday morning near the Rockwood Airport. Crews searched for hours before finding the wreckage in the woods. 10 News reporter Katie Inman spoke with Gellin's family and they say now there is a hole in their lives that will never be filled. There were few places Vass Gellin loved more than the volleyball court. He was a guy that always was full of energy. He moved to the U.S. from Moldova when he was 18. Literally lived the American dream. His cousin, Vio Rotar, says he's still numb from the news that Vass died in a plane crash Tuesday. It was also Vass's father's birthday. Everybody's devastated and people are just like, can't believe we lost him. A 911 call from Vass's flight instructor Jeff reveals Vass called him about engine trouble before crashing. He either uh, crashed or he landed in a, in a field. It, it sounded like he hit something and then the phone went out. A calm cry for help and an urge to search. We're going to see if we can locate him. If you hear from him, let us know. It took rescue crews hours to find his single engine plane in the woods. We all were shocked. I, I talked to Vass the day before this happened. He leaves behind a wife and two year old daughter. They had plans to camp and travel together the next two weeks. Unfortunately, it didn't happen. Uh, our plans didn't really line up with Supreme plans. Though his time here was short, Vio says Vass's impact will never be forgotten. I wish we had more time on this earth together, but there is time when we will see you again. From the sand to watching from the sky. In Knox County, I'm Katie Inman reporting. Next Thursday, Thursday, next week rather, Thursday, June 3rd, friends and family will celebrate Vass's life. Service is at 11 o'clock at the Slavic Gospel Church.